morning welcome back to another vlog so i washed my hair this morning and i'm waiting for it to dry speaking of hair i really really want slash need to get my hair done but my husband and i's birthday are in april and so i'm waiting or i'm trying my best to wait till it's closer to my birthday to get my hair done i'm also going to try and wait to get my nails done up until then that way i have like a little mini tiny glow up so today i have a busy little morning for work i have quite a few emails that i need to respond to so i'm going to spend the next hour or so just responding to emails i think i mentioned that for work i'm working on a project so I kind of just need to get an update, check the status on that. So I have a little bit of a busy morning. I also have a few little errands to run. I feel like running to Target qualifies as an errand. And then also it was my mother-in-law's birthday this week and we're going to take her out for dinner tomorrow. So we're going to go grab her a gift. And then after that, it'll most likely be time to go pick up the kiddos. But yeah, so today, of course, another simple day in the life. So something that I want to do for an upcoming video is I would like to do a q and A. I had asked you guys for some video suggestions in my last video and I think a couple of you asked for a q and A, and I think that'd be great. However, I don't have TikTok, I don't have Instagram, so I'm trying to think of a platform or something that you can do like a Q&A on. So I need to find something and then as soon as I find it, I'll probably let you guys know in next week's video or maybe I'll do it like on my little community tab. By the way, thank you all so, so much for all of the sweet comments and for all of the congratulations for passing my exam. Last week I had mentioned that I really needed to study because I had an exam this past Sunday and I really wanted to jump into Swift and Saddled, but I told myself that I was going to reward myself with if I pass my exam, I'd be able to jump into Swift and Saddled. However, I cheated a little bit and I actually got started on it that Saturday. <laughs> And then Sunday morning, I just spent the whole morning studying, took my exam, passed it, and then I went ahead and jumped right back into Swift and Saddle. So we wrapped that up. Today is Thursday. I think I wrapped it up on Monday or Tuesday. And I loved it. Cannot wait for, I think it's Lost and Lassoed. And that is the oldest brother in the Rebel Blue Ranch series. And then, so after I finished Swift and Saddled, I jumped into Once Upon a Broken Heart. But I had also mentioned that I wanted to jump into the fantasy genre. So I went ahead and jumped into Once Upon a Broken Heart. I'm currently on chapter 12. Oops. I'm currently on chapter 12. So, so far so good. Again, I figured there was going to be a little bit of world building. But yeah, but so far I'm actually really, really liking it. So I can't wait to get some more reading done. But yeah, so I'm just waiting for my hair to dry. I'm going to go ahead, get some work done, and then I'll probably just throw some mascara on and I may just straighten my hair. I always curl my hair, but I think I may go ahead and straighten it today. So anyways, once we get ready, we'll go ahead and head on out. So now that we have our mascara on and we curled our hair, I was going to straighten it, but of course, as always, I go with my curls or my waves instead. So let's go ahead and head on out. I think it's so neat. 
to see Restless Road on the radio. We've gone to see Kane Brown twice and they've been touring with him like since then. But I've never seen them on the radio so I think it's just so neat. We just got to Target. It's really cloudy and we're supposed to have some rain. But I figured I could use a few steps. So I'm actually going to... Let me turn the camera around. So I need to go over to James Avery right over there. So I need to head over to James Avery and I think I'm just going to walk on over to Target. So let's hope I don't get rained on. So we're in the pickup line. It was that weird time to where I could have gone home, but by the time I would have got home, it would have already been time to make my way to come pick up my daughter. So I am currently in the pickup line and I thought I'd go ahead and do a little Target haul for you guys. I did get a grilled cheese for lunch and then I got a passion tea lemonade. Before we went remote, our building had a Starbucks and I used to always get this and it's my favorite. It's a passion tea lemonade and I just remembered that I basically remade the same recipe like at home. I'll probably have to show you guys. I think I have it like on an old Pinterest like upload. Okay, so of course you guys know we had to get our chocolate covered strawberries. You guys know I get these almost every single time that we go to Target. They're my absolute favorite. And then we got some frozen strawberry and bananas. My favorite, favorite smoothie is a strawberry banana. So we always have frozen strawberry and bananas at home. I also got this cute little gift bag for my mother-in-law and then just this little like matching tissue paper to go with it. And then I did my nails in a few videos back and I don't remember if it was exactly these but I, like I mentioned I really want to wait till I go get my hair done to get my nails done because they're really weak again even though I just got them done once. So I may go ahead and put these on today at home. And for some reason whenever I do these little glue-ons even though it's nail glue it doesn't damage my nails and while I have these on it actually helps my nails kind of like grow and get a little bit stronger so as crazy as that sounds it's what works for me so I want to go ahead and maybe put these on today and then I was out of my conditioner this is actually a hair mask however I use it as a conditioner and then I wanted to go into the book aisle however they were kind of like redoing it reorganizing it so I really didn't get to look much so I hopped on the Target app to see if they had Hopeless and Heartless because those are the last two that I need to complete my Chestnut Springs collection and it said that it was no longer being sold at my Target so I think I may just order them. I needed a few like little staple pieces. You guys know that my uniform is just an oversized t-shirt with some leggings 
and I do get dressed up on the weekends. Maybe I'll vlog on a weekend. That way you guys can see that I do actually kind of like dress up. But I got me a couple of simple little shirts. This one is just like a little ribbed baby pink tee. And then I also picked it up in a gray. So very simple, but it's just like little shirts that I can throw on. Maybe to like run an errand or just to be around the house. At James Avery, I really didn't find anything for my mother-in-law. So I ran on over to Ulta and they had the new, I showed a clip of it, but they had a new Marc Jacobs perfume. The one that we picked up for her smells so, so pretty. This is the Daisy Wild by Marc Jacobs. But yeah, this one smelled so, so pretty. So we went ahead and grabbed her this one. And I think my video will like barely be out before we see her so i don't think she'll see this but that is all i grabbed from target but we have about 20 minutes so i'm going to go ahead and read for the next few minutes Okay, so we're finally back home and I already got started on dinner. So while dinner is cooking, I'm going to respond to some comments. You guys are always so, so sweet and leave me some of the sweetest comments. So the fact that you take the time out of your day not to only watch my videos, but the fact that you guys take the time to also comment really means so much to me. So I always like to make sure that I take some time to respond back to you guys. I truly appreciate all of you. So I'm going to go ahead and respond to some comments. So we just finished eating dinner, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put my little acrylics on I actually had like filed them yesterday because the power was out yesterday and it was out from like I think 10 to like Four I believe so anyway since I was just here at home I went ahead and gave myself a little pedicure and then I went ahead and filed down my nails So I'm just going to take off the little clear coat and put our acrylics on and it's been raining so the sound of the rain right now is just so relaxing and comforting so as soon as we're done with our nails i want to put another dent into once upon a broken heart yeah let's go ahead and do our nails
so I have my little tea for the evening and then I just read a couple of chapters and I'm actually already loving it definitely let me know if you guys have read this let me know your thoughts down below but so far i'm on chapter 15 and i can't wait to read more of it but i'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here as always thank you guys so so much for being here i cannot thank you guys enough for all of your continuous support and i will see you all in my next vlog thank you so much for watching bye mm -hmm.